But first of all, it's current action, and for that we go to Highbury, where the ground staff at Arsenal have done a great job getting the pitch ready for this battle against Liverpool. But it's going to be a hard slog in heavy mud. These, then, are the two teams. Arsenal had a late shock. Striker John Radford's got a muscle injury, and uh, Liam Brady comes in at number nine. Trevor Ross, a young Lancashire lad, is the sub. Liverpool unchanged. Phil Boersma gets the sub spot for them. Nobody in the crowd, of course, would be more interested uh, in this game than the England manager, Don Revy. In the centre there, on the right, of course, Jimmy Tarbuck. And I wouldn't mind betting that the talk at this moment is more about golf than football. A free kick then to Liverpool. But by now, Arsenal have got everybody back behind the ball. Bar Brian kick. Hughes with the free kick. Hit again, inevitably towards Toshak, gets in there, McNabb having trouble getting it away, Toshak gets it in again, Lindsay with the shot just over! Again, the threat of Toshak in the air, setting it all up again, when the ball came out to him he had a shot, that was only half cleared, and Lindsay had, if anything, an even more powerful shot, and that just cleared the crossbar. So it's with ball. Played it again towards Brian Kidd. Story is in there too. Now Tosha. And Story up there. Now Brady. Chance to cross in towards Kidd. Played back for Armstrong. Oh, Kidd now. Ball. Yes, and a ball. What a good game he's had. And McNabb now sending Story on his way. Nice little ball there played for Bob McNabb. There's the cross again. Oh, and Clements was in all sorts of trouble. Ball with the shot just over. And it was deflected there by a Liverpool defender. And it's another corner for Arsenal. And Ball getting in on the end again of that Arsenal move. Left foot shot that time. A deflection that sends it over. Harold Davy from Nottingham, and it's a corner which Brian Hall's going to take now for Liverpool. A deep floated one there. Rimmer's going for it, punching it away. Neil is there. He's got Hall available. Onto the left foot this time. Still not away by any means, and it's still not away. Lindsay going in there this time, and still it isn't away. Lindsay with a shot. Oh, and what a save by Rimmer. And Toshek turned it through for a shot as well. And now Arsenal can get it away. Tremendous save there by Jimmy Rimmer. Ball down and injured. And now it's now for Matthews. A penalty. Lindsay brings down Matthews. The referee has no hesitation. And Alan Ball is at the far end of the field, is the man who normally takes the penalties. I wonder if he's fit enough to. There's Ball. Matthews went through and was pulled down by Lindsay. And it's going to be Brian Kidd. Brian Kidd, then, who has placed the ball on the spot. But I know it's going to be Ball who's going to take it. Now, could Ball make it his second goal? And the second for Arsenal. Can he beat Ray Clements? This could be the killer goal. And the responsibility is with Ball and Clements. Yes! <laughs> Lindsay, Rice, Ross. Played for Armstrong. Ross again, controlled that well, what a good piece of play, our young Trevor Ross there. Armstrong now can measure this cross, Brady is going in there, Kidd is there too, here's Brady, there's the shot, oh, and it's just over. Well, it was uh, Trevor Ross, the youngster, who started that.
started up with that little pass to Armstrong. The cross came over and they were in all sorts of trouble until Brady put it over. Cormac. Tennille. Paul. Into the path of Neil. Now, is this a chance for Liverpool to pull one back? Neil! Oh, what a save by River! What a great surging run that time by the young Liverpool number two, Phil Neil, the man they bought from Northampton. He's not scored since he uh, joined the Anfield club, and he could hardly have come closer then. Great save by River. Here's Callaghan with the cross again, and that time, River making a nice save by his standards there, a comparatively easy catch. chance to sparkle again as the pass comes in here now for Brady still with Brady but there are white shirts back now it's so much more difficult McNabb coming up to support and he won't have time to do that the whistle is gone and two sides have shown that these sort of conditions can be conquered and Arsenal have shown they've got a lot of spirit in them still and John Matthews the man there the number four for Arsenal has played as well as anybody in this side. A youngster with a tremendous future. A great battle all afternoon between Mancini and Toshak. And the fellow, of course, who in the end was the difference between the two sides. Not on the field at the moment. Scorer of both the Arsenal goals, Alan Ball. One in the first half and a penalty in the second half. Applause all around Highbury for the whole Arsenal side, not least for Jimmy Rimmer there, who brought off one or two tremendous saves, as indeed did Ray Clements, and that's where Jimmy Rimmer's going now, the handshake of the goalkeepers, a fine afternoon's football at Highbury, which leaves us with a final scoreline that reads Arsenal 2, Liverpool 0.